Superior rectus. Inferior rectus. Medial rectus. Lateral rectus. Inferior oblique. Yeah. And then back here. At the top is the tendon of superior oblique. So this is the cornea. Cornea. In this white part of the eye is the sclera. The sclera. That's the ciliary muscle. Ciliary muscle. Cilia, that white circular part is the ciliary muscle, okay? That is the iris with the pupil. The iris with the pupil, which is where the color of our eye is. And then six. This big brown vast area is called the choroid, the layer of the retina. Now we're going to open up um, the eye so we can examine a little bit closer and find uh, the retina. It's on the top. Okay, so at the top portion of our eye we have... The retina's right there. The retina. Yeah, optic. Optic disc. This is number 14. Yeah, retina is number 9. Number 9, which is upside down well, right now, like but it's a 9. And that is the retina. Now this is the top portion of the eye. Mm -hmm. Yeah, top portion. The lens. That's the lens. Yep, that top part right and there, it comes right off. And this whole thing is the vitreous body. Mm -hmm, the vitreous body and the lens. Right where your finger is. Oh, right there. Right there is 13. And that is the? Macula fulvia centralis. Macula fulvia centralis. Number one is the auricle. And number two here is the external acoustic meatus. And then underneath here we have number three, which is the tympanic membrane. And now we have number six. Number six on the ear is the tensor tympani muscle. And then number seven. Number seven is the pharyngotympanus tube. And then we have number eight here. Number eight, malleus. And then number nine, right next to it. On the opposite side there is the incus. Then we have, let's see here, number 11, which is right here. Tiny, tiny, tiny number 11 is the stapes. Right next to it is number 13, the oval window. 14. There's number 14. And 14 is the round window, which is in two spaces, possibly indicating where we should rest the round window. Alrighty, and then on top here we have number 15, which is the lateral semicircular canal. And then number 16 here is on the opposite side. Anterior to that, which is the anterior semicircular canal. And then we'll turn back around and we have 17 right here. Which is the posterior semicircular canal. And then now we have number 18. Looking like our little snail body, which <laughs> is the cochlea. And number 19. Number 19 is vestibulocochlear nerve. <laughs> number 46, cervical plexus. 48, brachial plexus. 52, auxiliary nerve. 53, musculocutaneous nerve. 54, Radial nerve, 55, median nerve, 56, ulnar nerve, 60, medullary cone, 61, cauda equina, 62, lumbar plexus, 67, femoral nerve, 68, Obturator nerve, 
70 sacral plexus, 71 sciatic nerve. And then down here on the leg, we have number 73 superficial peroneal nerve, 74 deep peroneal nerve, 75 saphenous nerve, and then number 77 is the tibial nerve. Frontal lobe, number one. Number two, parietal lobe. Number three, occipital lobe. Number four, temporal lobe. Number five, central sulcus. Number six, precentral gyrus. Number seven, postcentral gyrus. Number eight, olfactory bulb. Then we'll split it open. Number nine, anterior commissure. And number 10, corpus callosum. Number 14 is the insula. Number 16 is the lateral ventricle. Number 17 is the choroid plexus. Number 18 is the hippocampus. And I thought it was a George shirt. Number 19 is the thalamus. Number 21 is the hypothalamus. Number 23 is the pineal gland. 24 is the left mammillary body. 25 is missing, but it was right in that area. It's the pituitary gland, pituitary, my bad. And number 26 is the choroid plexus of third ventricle. 34 is the aqueduct of midbrain. This is the cerebellum, number 35. A is the vermis, oh, God. B is tonsil, C is flocculus, D is arbor vitae, and then number 36 here is the pons, number 37 is the medulla oblongata, and 39 is the pyramid.